Wendy, I'm actually about to go. Would you mind coming outside with me for a second? Yeah. I mean, it's just I would like to talk to you to the side. When Candace and Giselle told me about Michael and the strip club, I appreciated the fact that they came to me as a woman I'll nearby. I'll talk to my husband about it. Presenting it to her this way helps her to understand that I'm not doing it to be messy. Perhaps this could bring Wendy and I closer together because we do share the commonality of someone coming for your marriage. You know, I wasn't at the dinner last night to know, like, all that was in, right? But Giselle told me how there is this fabricated article about Eddie or whatever, having an affair or something. This has been discussed, if that's one of the reasons why you are stepping in to be more, like, sexual, why you and Eddie are more free, because you're showing people, like, this, there, there obviously is no truth to that. Okay, we're not talking about that, because that's a lie. But I thank you so much for um, trying to find this opportunity to try to attack my marriage. Why the, is this where you're choosing to go? Why, no, why I, are I, you no, getting no, so you defensive said, in that? Right? I mean, first of all, the fact that you're bringing this to me, I find that laughable. Like with Giselle, the same way she wanted to have the conversation with me at dinner, if you really were hearing these things, why didn't she do this? I promise you, just and I were not, we've never talked about you maliciously. This is not like something we talked about to be like, hee, 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 ha, ha, ha. I'm serious. I feel like it is because Giselle, that, that's Giselle's personality. In her heart, yeah, it was completely evil. I don't think so. I think so. I think it's because last night it was already so fractured, your relationship. But she didn't know until today that it hurt me. So last night she could have talked to me. She that's chose fair. not to. So, no, but yeah, she's definitely a spawn of the devil. Oh, dear. Okay. I'm just going to do a quick toast. There are good ships and there are wood ships, the ships that sail the sea. Yes. But the best ships are the friendships. The friendships. May they always be. Oh, that's nice. Oh, cheers. Cheers. I read so much bad stuff about you, Ashley, you and your husband. Of course. I read so much bad stuff about Giselle. So many evil things about Ryan. I see it. Don't make sure. But you guys chose to bring up the thing about me and my husband. That speaks about your character. If that's what we're doing, let's have at it. You and Jack. All right, there you guys hold that. <laughs> yes. Thank you so much. Thank you. You are welcome. Pop okay, it, pop okay. it, pop it, pop it, pop it, pop hey, it, pop hey, it. Hey. <laughs> yes! <laughs> hey guys, since we're all twerking, something in which she said you guys saw in a blog about my husband. Who is who is y'all? She she said Giselle's name, but I don't know who it is, so you can. Was it you? Actually, was it not. You? Was it you? Oh, Actually, oh, yeah. I don't know. Oh, wait, I don't know. Was it you? I don't know. Show them Let's be very clear. Don't attack my husband. Yeah. Because that's something I do not play with. Why are you looking at me? I'm looking at you because it was your ass having the conversation with Ashley. Did you tell her what I said? I'm not having the that conversation. It was, I said that it was false, that we didn't believe there was any fiber of truth. Instead of you coming to me as a woman, mm. you decide to talk to Ashley. And so I'm putting your ass on notice mm. because what you're not going to do, let very clear is you're not going to play with my husband's name don't with my family and i'm saying it to you kindly i don't care if you say it meanly you know i don't give a don't get your ass to it don't okay wendy i told this one and i'm telling you i'm saying it to you i didn't believe it if we sat there and was like I wonder who the girl is and i wonder who this and i wonder who that that's one thing look we sat there and immediately said is not true. The end. Let, let me Why be very clear. Up? The vlogs did. These motherfucking cameras. I don't care. I'm telling you they're very here. clearly. They're here. When you talk about my husband, you Nobody, talk about me. No one believes it, it's Wendy. It's not about it being true. It's about you not having any dignity not to true. say 
I'm going to come to you as a woman to have the conversation. What was said about Eddie? Don't worry. If you want to know, your friend will tell you. No, I want to know from you. You're I want to know what you're receiving as them talking about your husband. Don't worry. Don't worry. The messengers are going to tell you. Some came in saying, say, everyone in the group, moment. I have an announcement to make. I don't and either, don't say what was said. You, what was you said. want a moment so bad, girl. I worry don't want a moment. Shut the up. You call your yourself. Oh, I don't myself yourself. Just like that with ski breath. You don't even have a relationship to even care about. Cracker, because you've had a lot of whiskey. Go to sleep. I don't give a Y'all can say what you want about him. I'm not going to give it this much energy and be so upset. Like, I'm so mad that you talked about a blog. Oh, my God. <laughs> a blog, a blog, a blog. <laughs> Wendy, I, I think because I don't take those things seriously at all, especially if it was brought to me the way I brought it to you, it doesn't. I mean, I am sorry that you feel like I'm attacking you and your family. When that really wasn't my intention. I'm going to want to bring it up to her. So... Ashley and I discussed it. It was just, hey, let's just check on Wendy. I said to you, maybe I'll discuss it with you privately. But she doesn't understand the parameters regarding people's husbands because she doesn't have a relationship that holds water. I see you for everything everybody ever said that you were. Thanks. Everything Thanks. everybody it was not said malicious. that you are. What's so funny? The life you're living now is exactly God paying you back for all the bullshit you've done. So live in your mother truth because God is paying your ass out? back. That's real shit. The life you're living now is exactly God paying you back for all the bullshit you've done. So live in your mother truth because God is paying your out? ass back. That's real shit. You wanna fire your shots, baby girl? I got the mother bazooka. I will drag you up and down the street over my husband. Don't play with me. What the? What? Is, what was Why said? Would Wendy put that into the universe about her husband. Giselle is coming after me because misery loves company. Giselle lacks empathy. Giselle lacks a man. Giselle lacks Brian. That's her middle name. Everybody and their grandmother has made up all kinds of bullshit about me. It's not true. Keep it pushing. Come on. If you want to go, Wendy, we, can get, it pop. Oh, we can get it pop. We can get it pop. No, I knew you all before no. I came on this show. We're not talking about blogs anymore, baby girl. Imagine being with a man that consistently cheats on you all the time and sleeps around all of Baltimore and everyone knows it, but you continuously be with this person and think he's worthy enough to bring him around your daughters. Like, you know how low of a self-esteem you have to have? Who's she talking about now? Who's your mom? Your mom? Okay. Uh, okay. You see the difference? Okay. Tread lightly. All right. Sorry. I'll see y'all. Light your ass up. <sighs> that is not how that was supposed to go. Just not. It what was, was, it what really was your wasn't. motivation for that? Like, especially you of all people. Do I look Why as though... Why bringing that into the group? It's online. Leave it online then. I have never brought anything from a mother blog to no, you. you the fact that you would bring you that into the sh you just tells me it. what I need to you know about you. It. Take your milk and get the you feed it. You're the culprit. You're the source. Hi, everybody. Good night. Okay, good night. Good night. Thank you so much. I'll see you guys later, okay? Yeah. Okay, bye, Ashley. Bye, thank you. Bye. Girl, she's miserable. She's so miserable. What is happening right now? Oh, my God. Like, you can't talk about eating placenta. Clearly, you ain't eat <laughs> enough. <laughs> miserable ass. If Giselle would have brought that to you directly, would you have had that same reaction? No. Why? Because I would at least try to give her some credit. Girl. So why wouldn't she come at, at Eddie, who looks like Idris Elba, honey? The same person who she said that she would up and down. <laughs> I mean, I'm going to ignore it. Huh.
Girl. Okay, this is Hello. gonna live. Uh, All right, so let's just now say what she needs to say. Maybe she, she just had, had the opportunity. She doesn't exist. She's not here. Yeah. It's nothing malicious. I actually like Eddie. We all knew about the blog. Every last one of us knew. Only one of us decided to talk about it. Yeah, what she says will trigger me, and I don't want to take it there because I have proof and I have respect and I was raised well. I'm not breaking bread with that bitch ass. Time to go. Next time on The Real Housewives of Potomac. I am honored to present this token to Miss Karen Huger. I am very nervous to be sworn in as the ambassador to Surrey County today. Thank you. <laughs> I would love for us to talk whenever you want to talk. Like Not brain. to your brains, just to win. You have association beef. No, 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 no. I know who's not invited to my wedding. I, don't have to. I know who's not invited to a bridal shower. I know who's not invited to shit. I need some extras for my music video. Then you don't belong here. She said a weak bitch. Something along that line. I would love for you to explain to me why the moment I left the house, you said she's a weak bitch. Who said that? What did she say?